Michael Chiesa and Max Griffin in the UFC welterweight division. Both guys coming off a win uh, recently. Max just got a very close decision over Jeremiah Wells. Chiesa just submitted Tony Ferguson. Uh, they're both pretty old in this welterweight division. 37 years old on the day. Michael Chiesa turns 37 the day of the fight. And then Max Griffin is 39 years old as of... Uh, Basically, like yesterday, I think he turned 39 yesterday. So, um, two older veterans of the UFC fighting against each other on these prelims here. Chase is a little bit taller, but not as lengthy as Max Griffin. Max is obviously much, much better on the feet, way better striking, way better hands, good takedown defense, and it's a it's a classic. This guy wants the fight to go to the ground. This guy wants it to stay on the feet. I do believe Max Griffin should be able to keep this one on the feet. Um, there's a few fights where, you know, he loses, very, very close ones, like uh, the Neo Magni one, he's able to keep it decently close with Michael Morales at times as well, uh, but we haven't really seen Max Griffin go out there and really get out-grappled significantly at all in the UFC. I mean, he's only been finished once in his MMA career, it was a knockout, he's never been submitted at all in his uh, in his mixed martial arts career, and nobody's really dominated him in the wrestling and grappling. For those reasons, I, I think this one stays on the feet, and I think Max Griffin goes out there, rocks him a few times, but overall wins the unanimous decision.